What's up, homie? It's Zombie Route 35 here, and today, I thought welcome I to you episode here. two of Batman. The news was upsetting for both of us, but you should see this. I know you come here for solitude, Bruce. More allegations about his ties to the underworld. Damn it! This isn't going away. They're it's trashing my family. You messy. hide this from me. This can't be true. They're trashing People my family. People are throwing stones at my family, Alfred. I need to understand why. It's my family too. Don't forget that. Oh, I'll never forget that, Alfred. I've been dreading this day for nearly two decades. Also, I'm twenty. And I hoped it would never come. Forget the papers. I want to hear it from you. The truth is, they were billionaires, Bruce. You can't amass that kind of wealth without making certain moral compromises. It's just not possible. That kind of money taints you. My oh, money has never corrupted me, and I'm proud of you. But you're hardly the norm. Yeah, <laughs> true, Batman. Hill greased the wheels of politics. Falcone was the muscle. Thomas legitimized the whole enterprise with his name. Your father, Hamilton Hill, and Falcone, they were partners. Damn. Nothing happened in Gotham without them knowing. You've never you told me this. That. And you never let on. You're behaving like I was part of the conspiracy. Shit, I, I want am. you to know, I had my suitcases ready. I couldn't stand to be around your father anymore. Damn. But then, they were killed. And you were all alone and I just couldn't walk out the door everything I did everything I've ever done was out of love for you I hope you can forgive me I'll forgive you homie how can We're I still... hold this against you you're all I've got Alfred thank you I won't let you down again A little fucking pup this is the first time I've been back here since that night. When the police called me to collect you, I thought they'd finally arrested your father. I couldn't believe a low-life thug like Joe Chill would have the audacity to rob and kill Thomas Wayne. Yeah, it wouldn't make he sense either. He was simply too well known. Too... too big. Yet, there it was. If my, my father, father was that deep in crime, he would have had enemies. Well, it's a fair assumption. You don't think. You always said it was a simple mugging. In 20 years, you've never wavered from that story. I can recall every moment of that night in vivid detail. But maybe that's wrong. Sometimes we block out things we don't want to face. Maybe there was some detail I overlooked. Hmm. All right. Uh, we we in control? Yeah, we're in control. Now this game before I tried recording this once before, and the game ran like shit. All right, I'm I'm, I'm gonna be dead honest with you guys. That's why you didn't see it for a while because standing here. now it right runs now. like awesome. And what would the Batman do with his own parents killer? The possibilities are frightening. I take him to jail, just like any other criminal. But he's not just any criminal, is he? I, I won't, like, I won't let Bruce go down that killing act. In prison. No one mourns for Joe Chill, Bruce. He literally uh, is the only superhero that will say no to killing. Fuck, Superman and Wonder Woman's all for it, so like, he's the only person that won't. So I gotta keep him on that right path. He just wanted to protect us. He thought he was invincible. Sadly, he was mistaken. I wanted to I be always like wanted him. to be brave. Just like him. And you are. He would be so proud to see that you took a different path. I gotta make sure that I keep taking a different path because I gotta make sure he doesn't become his father like corrupt and fucking retarded. By the way, why didn't his father have a gun? 
I've always looked at the beginning scenes. What made Batman? I love that. Why didn't his father have a weapon? Countless times at that theater. Like he was a mobster. He should. Ah, here it goes. The texture glitches, guys. I'm sorry. Your mother arranged the special Wait a minute. No, is that just? I don't know. I never knew that. It's it's between like texture glitches and the game itself trying to do it. Hopefully they get better on time. I've seen season two, so I'm trying to get season one done, so BO4 won't have like any interruptions. Where exactly does the memory end? With my father pleading, you don't have to do this. Damn. And the gun fires. And after that, uh, there are considerable gaps in that recollection. Maybe. Do I really want to know? Fuck, it's the past. I guess you would. Like, I I'm trying to move. It's not letting me. Uh, this is how you tell a backstory right here, people. That stumbled upon this video. Stay back. Take whatever you want. Nothing personal. Just business. He told me you had it coming. You, you don't have to do this. Stop it! Don't fall, Cody. This making the Fuck, these texture glitches are annoying. I'm really hoping it's just this one episode that does it. Fuck, shot very Or was it just the flashback? Because we haven't seen that yet. Yeah, right. He did Wasn't you about all that? They were assassinated, and Carmine Falcone knows why. We about to go in, homies. Batman, let's go, let's go. About to go in, boys. Yeah, but I just want to get the series out of the way, so Bo4 wouldn't have any setbacks because I will really want to play BO4 really bad <laughs> without any interruptions that's why Injustice 2 and th this these um, episodes will be coming out really regularly as my main time vid videos just for maybe a week so don't worry and I know we got plenty of time for BO4, but there's still news on BO4 to and on World War 2 I need to cover. I don't have to tell you how many rules we're breaking. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm always here for you, but this could land us both in hot water. I'm gonna try to get you I not to face. All the strings I had with the lieutenant. This better not come back to bite us. And I appreciate Look, I it, homie. I get that hard, okay? And it means a lot to me. I know it does, Bruce. It doesn't make it any easier. The last time we brushed shoulders with Falcone, the press made us pay. Fuck him. At least tell me what this is about. Look, I'm all for blind support. I'm not I'm sure. I'm telling him true. I think Falcone put a hit on my parents. Wait, what? Yeah. Bruce, that's... that's terrible. That's why I have to speak with him. I have to know for sure. Bruce, I appreciate you opening up to me, but just try and keep it cool in there. I don't want any headlines taking it's away from the debate Batman with him. Beating the shit out of him. Well, we finally put Falcone in his cage. Now, well, thanks to the information you gave me, Bruce, he won't ever get out. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, information? What information? What'd I give him? Oh, well, I assumed you knew. I was going to contact your office first thing. I gave him some evidence against Falcone. Uh, more like a catalog of his entire criminal empire. It's a case that'll put Falcone away for life. Is that a fact? Damn it, I should have told him. I said yes to this unorthodox request. Nice job bringing in Falcone. 
Yeah, that son of a bitch better not get off again. He's not getting off the hook, Rene. Not this time. Mr. Wayne, Sergeant Rene Montoya. I just wanted to say, you know, some of us police support you, despite what the media is saying. Thank you. Thanks, Sergeant. We need more people like her. <laughs> We're keeping Falcone in the infirmary. He's lucky he didn't get roughed up more. I could tell Batman wanted to kill him, but he held back. He cares about doing the right thing. Whoever he is behind the mask, Batman's a hero to me. Yeah, it's great to know he's out there watching over the city. I'm trying. I'm trying to like get right, everybody Falcone's on Batman's inside. good side, so they won't just start say shooting what you at gotta him. Say. <laughs> we'll be out here. Listen, don't be alarmed if I beat this motherfucker's ass. <laughs> Batman wanted to kill him. That's that should still be a knock. You're saying, oh, I'm Batman. The children of Arkham. Mm, I'm getting excited. Fuck yeah. The hell, Bruce Wayne? Yeah. You must have some clout. My own wife can't get in to see me. <laughs> Good thing I'll be out of here in a week. <laughs> Just like every other time they tried to put you me You deserve away. to go to jail. You know you're going to die in jail. <laughs> I'll get witness protection in Tahiti, kid. I'm dying on the beach. <laughs> Talk like that. You remind me of your father. Yeah, that's right. Tommy and I were close. More than friends. More like cousins. Going back decades. Tell Did me what you, you know. Have something to do with his death. Ah, so that's what this is really about, eh? The pop digging up a 20-year-old killer. Two killings, and they were never forgotten. You and me, we're practically family. I thought you'd have figured that out by now. Hey, I tried to get through to your dense party. Maybe I should have spelled it out. Got a whole closet full of birthday presents I was never able to give you. We are not family, Falcone. I'm nothing like you. If you're anything like Thomas Wayne, then we're not so different. Your father, Hill, and me, we ran this city. Still do. <clears throat> God damn this pain. Can't think through it. Morphine's on the side there. Be a good boy and help Uncle Carmine out, huh? You know what? I will help him. If I don't stab it into his fucking eye. Why do I feel like Batman would do that? <laughs> Ease his pain. I'm, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be a dick to a man that's that's gonna die anyway. Not a spoiler, I just have that feeling. Forty years I keep my veins clean of any of that gunk. But you never forget the tender kiss. It'd be so easy to give me the whole vial, wouldn't it? Enough there to put an old dog down forever. Of course you'd never know the whole story. How much of your parents do you have in you? I'm not a murderer. No, I'll never be. you're not. That's why you were kept in the dark. Much better, kid. Thank you. <laughs> Just you like that reminds me of your mother. Your father may have been the doctor, but Martha... She had the human touch. Think you got more of her in you, tell the truth. Yeah. There's a kindness in you. I don't remember. I lost her so young. I hardly remember anything about her. She had steel in her, did Martha. She was the only one that ever had a hold on your father. Until you hired an assassin to kill them both. What, you really think I hired Chill? Sure. I worked with Joe Chill from time to time. Put a button on someone, he'd take him out. But I never ordered that hit on your parents. Why so do I... who did? I want to believe him. You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friend. Your parents learned that. 
Doctor, waiting for you in hell. She she's infected. Up A. Uh, I mean X. And then playing too much the Xbox. Bastard had to die. <sighs> Hands in the air! Stand down! Get a doctor! Secure this floor! No one gets in or out! Damn. Go! Go! Damn, I was being so nice too. I just went all nice for nothing. I thought he was gonna like grow old dead. Because he's already an old man. I didn't think he would just get shot in the fucking jaw. Damn. That chick really made sure that he was dead. And we are in deep shit. I bought us some time, but not much. Word's gonna get out, sooner or later. Why would she do something like this? We had Gotham's biggest crime lord in our grasp. Mm. This close, we were this close. Something was wrong with her. I, I saw, I saw that know. lip shit. I hardly recognized her when she burst in. She was so different from the woman we met in the hall. <sighs> it's a disgrace. Another officer gone rogue. Nah. It just doesn't make any sense. She'd never do anything to hurt the department. Oh, Falcone's case meant justice for a thousand unnamed victims. And now it is a PR disaster. How can I run against corruption when our own cops are redecorating the precinct with their prisoners' brains? That is very true. So we gotta get out in front of this. We gotta spin it as best we can. Issue a statement saying that we have the shooter in custody. That details are still coming in and that we're investigating. The, the we need usual. to get facts first. Slow down, Harvey. We need the facts first. The simple fact is she walked in and shot him. Then we need the complex facts, like how and why. Lieutenant, uh, Mr. District Attorney, uh, Falcone's lawyers are here. Oh, Christ. I can delay them for a little while, but we still need answers. You better not Tell even me wait. If she says anything. I have to know why she did this. You don't wake up? Oh, does Batman need to beat your ass? Alfred, Falcone's been murdered. Good God! Not by me. I'm I didn't do it. it. But I'll need access to the back computer for anything I find. Connection secured. Alfred, I'm gonna try and confirm some suspicions of mine. Right there. Right there, the neck. A fresh injection site. That doesn't look like blood. Uh, mouth? Yeah, the mouth too was really infected. Right. Look at that. Still visible beneath her skin. Uh, what am I Alfred, I think I found the substance. Analyze and forward me the result. <laughs> what do I need of to course. do that? I'll be in touch as soon as I have the result. Where am I? Mr. Wayne? Hi. What's going on? Oh, but I got this awful feeling something terrible happened. We're here for you. What uh, do you remember? I do have to say that. Such a I can't just. You just. Sorry, you, you murdered somebody. What do you remember? Oh God, Falcone! I was hoping it wasn't real. Damn it, she remembers. I believe you were drugged, Sergeant. I. It would explain a lot. Listen, you have to believe me. I talked big about hurting thugs like Falcone, but I would never, never betray the lieutenant. Everything is so foggy. I remember a sharp pain. There's an injection site on your neck. Then I just felt light. Like I could do whatever I wanted. No guilt. No consequence. There was a voice in my ear insisting Falcone was going to get off. And all I knew was that I had to stop that. So you killed I him. I had to. No matter what. The reasons why... So I, I remember more. 
They were a I million miles know. away. You have to remember more, Montoya. Try. I remember a hand on my arm. Guiding me. Like a parent with a child. The voice. It was saying something about revolution. Oh, shit. Cobblepot said something similar. Yo. She been stabbed. I'm so sorry, Lieutenant. I've let you down. We stalled Falcone's lawyers for now, but they'll be back. So how is she? Did she tell you anything? Yeah, a yeah, lie. Hey, don't worry about that now. I found I needle marks. Evidence that she was drugged. A fresh injection site on her neck. I was out of my mind, Lieutenant. Please believe me. We hey, got I you. Do. Of course I do. Hey, get forensics in here. Now! She remembers a voice saying something about revolution. That's not much to go on. Now, if you're bringing forensics in, let's get Bruce out. Alfred, I gotta get back to the manor. I've got a lead on whoever's behind this. Bruce! Wh what are you doing here? My friends in the, in the GCPD have been telling stories about some kind of lockdown? I'm, I'm sorry, Vicky. I, I don't have time. Don't brush me off. I, I, do, I really Word don't is have there a were choice. Shots fired near where Falcone was being held. Know anything about that? I mean, you must have been back there when it happened. Where did you hear that? Where did you get that? So it's true? <laughs> no, I didn't say that. Word is you turned over enough dirt on Falcone to put him in Blackgate Prison for life. Yes. A day after he showed up at your house. Now you're here. You can't afford to be associated with another scandal. I can keep your name out of whatever we print, but you need to give me something I can use. Who fired the shots? A, a cop? No. I can tell by the way you're brushing me off that something happened. No deal. I'm sorry, Vicky. You're fishing. You don't have anything. Now if you'll excuse me. You should talk to me, Bruce. This is coming out whether you stonewall me or not. I don't trust Vicky for some reason. I don't know. It's just probably because I have actually a cousin named Vicky. And I still don't trust her. <laughs> I don't trust a person named Vicky. I don't know why. Very weird. Oh, Batcave. Here we go. I forgot what all we did like in episode one. It's been so long. I know I had to do a two-parter in the same day. Either Cobblepot drug Montoya himself, or someone else is using his revolutionary rhetoric. Either way, I need to find him. Let's put our drones in the air and start a search. I'll run a trace on his cell. Got in the meantime, chair. we have to find out what we can do about this drug. The computer's been analyzing the chemicals from Montoya's bloodstream. Throw that up on the monitor. The residue I scan on Montoya is similar to the nerve agent I found in the docks. Let's see what we got. It's ironic that Falcone died at the hands of someone drugged with his chemicals. Who'd have guessed that's how he'd meet his maker? <laughs> Prone in his sick bed, surrounded by it wasn't police justice. who were ordered to protect him. Murder at the hands of Montoya. That's not justice. Whoever did this was judge, jury, and executioner. No one should act as all three. I hope he told you something before he was killed. What did you learn from him? Practically family, he said. Family? Funny, I don't recall any Sunday dinners with the mob. <laughs> it wasn't Falcone who called the hit. Yes, well, I suppose that makes sense. Your father, Hill, and Falcone would have balanced each other out. Computers pinpointed reference points on the two compounds. Doc sample, control sample. Okay, they look a little different. Okay, they're combined in one. The minute the like. docs were doused with the base chemicals, the reaction was messy. They were out of control. I see. So the one control sample, but... Okay. A fine drug is like a weapon. 
It only took a small injection to strip Montoya of her moral filters and make her act on her base impulses. But she's... someone else is controlling it this time. Both compounds seem stable, but they're quick to fall apart. Whoever processed it knew what they were doing. What could the creators of such a drug possibly have in mind? Fighting your wars is one thing, but to create chaos, others to fight them for you. Oh. Considering the amount they stole from Falcone, they could build a small army of remorseless assassins. The thought is chilling. Your drones are in position to triangulate Cobblepot's location. All right, Cobblepot. Me and you about to fight, bitch. Wait, why don't we just call him? Are we in good terms on him? I don't remember. <laughs> um, okay. Yeah. Okay, I gotta drive this thing. It's very annoying. Alright, let me go off. There's like a green dot right here, obviously. Can't get it right on the spot, though. Okay, back up. Okay, there's no backup button. <laughs> Find her! Find her now! Send a strong message! Okay. Look for the green dot, basically. <laughs> it's my logic. I keep saying all right mainly because I really don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Nothing over here, okay. Let's be like up here or something. I'm getting really close, I feel. There we go. you go. Right. Boom. So we're not on good terms like with him. them. Jesus, didn't even wait for Falcone's body to get cold, did you, Oz? Going to speak with him, Bruce? Damn Bruce right. Bruce Wayne already tried talking with Cobblepot. It's time he met the Batman. So he's going to find him with punches. Beat his ass. <laughs> That's kind of what Batman does. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to make Batman a bit more talkative than in the comics. Not too much. Just, I guess, enough. Let's take this bitch out. Nope. Oh fuck. You lot, come check out this office. We're in trouble. Let's go, bitch. Let him go. Batman. It's about time. You kill a crime boss, you'd expect a word of thanks from Gotham's number one vigilante. Oh, don't worry, I'll pass your gratitude on to those who made it happen. I said, I said let him go. go. You hear that, Rowling? 
That sounded like an order. I'll crush him. Now, now, have a little respect for the bat. Think he underestimates you. Is this about Falcone? We all saw how you felt about Falcone. Pounded him into a pulp on live TV. If you were truly the defender of this city, you'd have finished the job yourself. Admit it, Falcone deserved to die. Vermin he deserved Falcone. justice. They deserve to be stomped out. Believe me, you went I too know. far. You don't decide who lives and who dies. That's not justice. But it's bloody well satisfying, isn't it? As <laughs> a show of good faith, I'm gonna let this one go. How's about we talk this through? We helped you with Falcone. Now, if we could just cut out the rest of the rot, like Wayne and Hill, ordinary folks might be able to breathe. You're the Oswald real one. Cobblepot. What is it about this place that attracts criminal scum like you? Gotta admit, you've got flair. Here's the thing. I actually admire you, Batman. I don't we both kill. want the same kinds of things. Me and my people, we've got big plans for Gotham. And I'll be beating your asses. They found Catwoman. What do you want with her? We had a deal. She didn't make good on it. You're about to die. So sorry this didn't work out, mate. I'd stay to watch. I would, but I still got a Catwoman problem to deal with. Or oh, what's her name again? Selena. Yes! Oh, beautiful name. <laughs> <laughs> and knock the motherfucker out. Fuck. That wasn't as hard because I hit square into a triangle. Now it's time to beat a motherfucker's ass though. I have to try harder than this. Um, please Let me back up there so I can beat him on the fucking ass. Come on at me now. Come on. Fight me like a man. Alfred, track down Selena Kyle. I'll find her right away. Huh. Sorry guys, it's like 9 at night. And I'm got a bag full of barbecue chips. <laughs> Not sponsored. Big fan, a big fan, huh? Fuck him. I just got the achievement, a big fan, by the way, if you guys are wondering. <laughs> like, the fuck big fan? What the fuck's wrong with this guy? I didn't know, see no damn big fan. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wait, we're going as Bruce fucking Wayne. God damn it. Of course we are. I'm really hoping this episode doesn't take like two to three hours just to do. Because <laughs> I gotta make other videos and maybe a Fortnite video because. <laughs> I don't know. So why I don't make much of those? I don't, I don't want to get views that way. Like I don't want to be a cheap little bitch. Oh, okay, I can move. That push me. You really think you'd show up here? I want to know. Do you think I'm gonna show up here? The cops raided his house. Sorry, his manor. You lost? Cause I don't have time for tourists. Looks like you walked into the wrong bar. You know Selena Kyle, there are men after her. Uh-huh, when aren't there? <laughs> well, these ones are trying to kill her. Hey, don't I know you? It is you. Knew it. The cops take all your fancy clothes? <laughs> are you trying to lay low? Of course, you're not really the low-lying type. Nice to meet you. Uh, Frank. Yeah. Funny seeing you here. 
So much in the papers. Whole other thing, meeting the man in real life. Hey, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to be nice, guys. You would be. Leave him alone, Frank. Man's just trying to have a quiet drink. He didn't seem to mind the company. Whatever. I didn't mind. For once, I'm not trying to fight somebody in a bar. Selena, <laughs> I need to tell you something important. Better be an apology. For what? You were supposed to take care of our mutual problem. Instead, you just pissed him off. Well, I've met a couple of his goons myself. Your client isn't one for subtlety. The man who hired you, his name is Oswald Cobblepot. Never heard of him. He goes by Penguin. Penguin? Shit. <laughs> yeah, you know how fucking you are. You've got to be kidding me. You should have just killed me on that rooftop. I'm dead anyway. When you screw someone over, you really screw them. <laughs> the penguin. <laughs> penguin we'll fight can't take together. on both of us, and I'm not going anywhere. Clearly you know something about him. I only know him by reputation. I'm surprised you never heard of him. He's a big deal across the pond. We He's more dangerous than you think. We grew up I grew together. up with Oz. He's the first real friend I ever had. I'm not surprised. Questionable morals and a penchant for theatrics? You two have a lot in common. <laughs> the question is, why Gotham? Why now? True. It's not like he's hurting for crime syndicates abroad. Why leave that? Oswald wanted Falcone out of the picture. Looks like he succeeded. So what? He wants to take his place? Damn Maybe. right. For starters. Well, I'm not sticking around here to find out. Oswald... Penguin is about to unleash God knows what on the city. You can't just leave. A good reason not to be here when he does. You want to stay? That's your choice. You would let Whatever people die? Whatever Penguin is planning, innocent people will end up in the line of fire. Innocence. Not me. Bruce. Sweetie. The gallant knight thing. It really is adorable. But what would Harvey think? The two of us working together. After all, I'm not really an all-work-and-no-play kind of girl. Harvey knows that. I thought you, you and were Harvey, dating. it's pretty clear you aren't just friends. Please, I'm just toying with him. I only take my claws out for someone special. No. Nope. You and I... Uh, it's about time to kick some ass. God damn it, I wanted one bar fight where I didn't have to do this. Oh well. Bruce, you really need to stay away from bars. You were right. Selena Kyle, Penguin says hello. Hello. Get some good music on. Beat it. We're here for her. You really think I'm gonna? You care about your own skin? You'll get the hell out. Fuck him. Where, where? Where are you getting in a bar fight? It's time to knock the motherfucker out. <laughs> Shit! You both better run. All right, let's go. <laughs> Damn, bitch. Kind of wish slow motion wasn't there. Damn. Oh, wasn't it? That was too easy. Come on. Do I have it on easy mode or something? I really want it on hard mode. I just want to know how this would work in hard mode. They just act on the state. Lock and. What are you doing, dude? I can't move the. Couldn't move it. He did not want me to move it. <laughs> Stop staring at her at. Not done yet. Do enough of that after the fight's done. 
How do you Well, not really very danger. They're not even using weapons. Like, come on, then, bitch. Knock out. I think they want more. Then let's give it to them. I think they underestimated how big that pool was. Or two stick. Fuck. I just like pulling the ears. Kinda looks like Damien Wayne. Uh, not Damien, uh, Big Grayson just beat the shit out of somebody with the full wheel stick. Oh, I think I fucked that up. I don't know. I hit it once and then it didn't go and I'm like, oh fuck, it didn't go. You fight pretty good for such a pretty boy. Come on, this way. I don't think the fight's done though. <laughs> like I'm thinking like 20 cops are right out the back door like surprise bitch. Ah <laughs> uh, never mind they're not smart cops. Quick check the alleyway. Really? It took you that long to check the fucking alleyway. Negative let's check the other side. Kiss her, you dumbass. Fuck it. Let's get out of here. I'll take the rooftops. Fuck it, you take geez. the alley. Wait. Just stay out of trouble. <laughs> Now, where's the fun in that? <laughs> you shouldn't trust me, you know. Alfred, I'm uploading the contents of a smartphone to the back computer. Check to see if there's anything on the phone we can use. I'm processing it now. Is everything all right? There are quite a few police cars convening on your location. It's fine. Has the back computer found anything yet? Bruce, there are a number of messages here. All from Mayor Hill. Mayor Hill? Uh, the last voicemail is his. Listen to this. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Hill's That's next. Very shady indeed. Whatever they're talking about, it doesn't sound good. Hill's working for him. Hill's working with Penguin. If Hill's talking to Penguin, he must know something. It's time I paid him a visit. I agree. The mayor must have answers, but if I may offer a word of advice... I'd go Batman. People look up to Batman yep. after how you handle Falcone. Terrorizing the mayor could damage that goodwill. Fuck, again, he's right. Batman's methods would certainly get him talking immediately. Bruce would have to depend on his guile to loosen Hill's lips. I'm going to go Batman because most of this episode's been like Bruce only. Going as Batman is the sure bet. If Batman's reputation can't get bit back, I don't think Bruce is can. Just in case shit goes south, Batman's name could be a little tarnished. Just a little. But I won't kill him. What are you looking for? <laughs> Batman. 
man has the public trust after taking down Falcone. Try not to throw it away by going overboard on Hill. I understand. I got it, Alfred. The city will thank me later if Hill tells me Penguin's plans. Deborah, you incompetent! Dent's up in the polls. Damn it. I need to crucify him in the debate or we can kiss re-election and your job goodbye. You'd better be back here in the next 15 minutes or you're your pay. Who's there? Deborah. Who's there? Nope. Deborah. Deborah's gone. Is that you? Expecting someone? Maybe the penguin. Oh. That's how you make a fucking entrance. Batman? What are you doing here? You know who Penguin is. So I've heard of him. So what? I've got nothing to do with that lowlife. Do you hear me? It's time to Patience start talking. Isn't my strong suit, uh, uh, Talk. I'm talking. You're not listening. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Wayne, there's the real problem. He's the one you should be after. Every fiber of his being built on lies. His status. His fortune. Nice try, but Bruce Wayne is clean. No one born into a pile of crap that deep can come out clean. I witnessed firsthand the atrocities of his family, and he's the one who profited. <gasps> Security! Pick up, goddammit! Security! Got yeah, you. I won't kill. Don't kill me. I've done nothing wrong. Do something I classic. I want the truth. And I'll break every bone in your body to get it. You're insane. Just like they say. A madman in a mask. Penguin wants revenge for what happened to his mother. Thomas Wayne sent her to Arkham, along with who knows how many other innocents. Nothing was wrong with any of them. Until Thomas locked them up. Something this big couldn't have been hidden. There'd be records. With enough money, you can make anything or anyone disappear. I didn't dare speak up. Whatever happened in the past, it's nothing compared to what's happening now. Penguin isn't the only child of Arkham. There are others whose families were destroyed by Wayne. They'll make Gotham pay for his sins. <laughs> no. Please. Don't. I'm... They'll come for you, too. You know that. You deserve whatever's coming for you. If I hadn't given Penguin what he wanted, he would have struck at the debate tonight. I didn't just do this for myself. I'm trying to protect Gotham. Okay. Finally. About damn time. It's Batman! Shoot him! Come on, get the mayor out of here! Goodbye. Still looking I heard nice. everything, Master Bruce. What he said about your father must be difficult to process. I need to know what went on in Arkham Asylum. Uh, indeed. I'm just as frustrated as you are. No, I don't think you are. <laughs> Hill seems to think he's safe, but Penguin's still out there. Yeah. Penguin might think he's safe, but I'm still out there. Sorry guys, if my crunching ever comes up in the mic, that's just me eating barbecue potato chips. No sponsor. Even though it's like original barbecue potato chips, it's not even like having a brand. Or... I wish they did, these are really good. Br Bruce, chill bro. I wonder what else is on here. As per your request, Lieutenant Gordon has tripled security at the debate. All right. Thanks, Alfred. But Gordon heard about Batman's surprise visit to the mayor. He was far from happy. Thanks for the heads up. It's a plan of the old Monarch Theater. The auditorium where the debate's being held. Hmm. 
I hacked into the image feeds from the security cameras at the auditorium. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Hells, details about your father. They must have been quite upsetting. I can't imagine how you must feel. To learn so much I'm, in so I'm little time. With it. To be honest, Alfred, nothing can shock me anymore. Not when it comes to my parents. I wish I felt the same way. But I suppose no good can come from wallowing. The city needs you now more than ever. I'll, uh, I'll leave you to it then. Eat Batman more than ever, not me. Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent. Of Fuck off. I am not worried about Wait a minute. Dent. The images on these cameras haven't changed. Something's wrong. Penguin's men may have commandeered the cameras on their end. We yeah. could just be looking at what they want us to see. Warn Gordon that he may have visitors. I have to get down there. Now. There we go. Turn the fucking bitches up. Let's go. I'm really hoping it's not gonna end like on that. Like. <laughs> oh, that would piss me off. <laughs> and uh, another reason why I want to. Like 30 minutes, maybe Harvey 11 minutes. I'm not going to be like 20 parts in. Hey, Bruce. Man, I'm glad you called. I needed to talk to you, actually. Something's come up. Something that's. You're in danger. Harvey, listen You're... to me. Your life is in danger. Because of Penguin and his thugs? Thanks, but there is an army of security here. They have me in some back room until the debate begins. For my own protection, they said. A little bit of overkill, if you ask me. It's not overkill, Harvey. It's a real... Please. I need to get this off my chest. Uh, look. Bruce, I didn't want to do this over the phone, but... My advisors are telling me that I need to... <clears throat> that I need to distance myself from you. Until all this mess with your family blows over. I understand. I, I get it. It's the smart move, but let's talk about that later. I'm glad you see it that way. What with the allegations in the press and now this mess with Falcone, you're a liability. But here's the thing, Bruce. Without your money, I am dead in the water. Shit. I know this is a delicate topic, but I need you to keep me afloat. I'll do I it. I may have to trash you in public. No. But you and me, we all know the truth about our friendship. Forget your campaign for a minute. The money won't matter if you're dead. Yeah, well, until I am, it is still my primary concern. Listen, I hate to push you, but I... I need to know. Can I count on your money, Bruce? Whatever it takes to save Gotham, that's what we of wanted. Of course. I'll always support you, Harvey. Oh, thank you, Bruce. Thank you. Just don't shit talk. You me don't as know much. how much this means to me. To Gotham. I'm sorry, Bruce. The makeup person is here. <laughs> Guess she needs to put on my face. I hope you can still watch the debate somewhere. Uh, no matter what I have to say tonight, remember. You are always my friend. Harvey! <laughs> Harvey? I figured I'd give him the money because, like, he's worked so hard, you know? And we've worked so hard just to get him up for this far. Batman! Yeah, all quiet so far. I've got a feeling that's about to change. Just so we're clear, you and me, we're on shaky ground. Fuck you. No, listen to me. The excessive violence, it, it can't go on. Most of the GCPD already think you're a monster. Don't prove them right. I do what the police can't. I get the job done. Now give me the report so I can do my job. Fine. 
Just do it without splitting anyone in half. Promise. We have bigger no things killing. to worry about right now. Your security has been compromised. I've got patrols on every door. You better check on them. Oh, hello. I'd keep that holstered if I were you. What's she doing here? She was part of that robbery at the mayor's office. Really? You're gonna drag out that dead horse? We're all on the same side, Jim. God trust you, bro. This better not come back to bite me. I promise. Alpha Patrol, will. come in. That, um, incident in the bar. It was fun. Dead is its own kind of cage. I can't stand being in it. Not that I needed your help or anything, but you had my back. I thought I'd repay the favor. You know, like you scratch my back, I cut some people up. Doing the right thing. Maybe there's hope for you yet. Don't read too much into it. I'm just <laughs> allergic to owing you anything. None of my men on the ground are responding. Enough waiting. We're going in. Alpha, do you read? Now aren't you glad I'm here? Now well, you have a better shot than my SWAT team of getting in there quietly. Well, we are seriously underfunded at the GCPD. Sounds like a vote for Dent, Lieutenant. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I would have actually gave some money to the GCPD. I can find them a bit, a hell of a lot more. So they wouldn't need Batman, like, hey, crimes they can take on. God damn it. Come on. Can I not take him down? Am I not in the rafters somewhere? Nobody checks the fucking rafters, I swear to god. <gasps> nope. We know why they weren't responding. Gordon, we found one of your patrols. God They've been it. terminated. Oh, God damn so sorry, ladies and gents. As you might have guessed, there's been a change to tonight's program. First order of business. Firing the moderator! I hate to be a downer, but these hostages, I don't like their chances. Oh, they just didn't have a head for the issues. Casualties are inevitable. It's only a question of how many. Inspiring. You really know how to pep a girl up. <laughs> You'll do. Get out here. Keep it quiet back there. These guys are armed to the teeth. Uh, we need a new moderator. Come on, you. You there. Yes. You. Oh, Thank you for wait. volunteering. Please. No. Go on, then. Introduce the candidates. Stage fright, huh? All right. I'll get you started. But this is your show. Three hostiles. Got to take them out quietly. I just really want to like take these guys. I'm going to link those to Selena. Smart. Don't leave it to Selena Kyle again. I'm kidding. <laughs> link. Oh, this is the only link there is. Mr. Dent, uh, the, the subject on everyone's mind is the new 
<laughs> I'm gonna beat the fuck out of this guy. <laughs>